just finished building another set and this is Ray Speeder. And it's cool. This is from the movie, The Star Wars. It is Sunday morning. Tristan and I are going for a run. We're gonna go with the Nomads. What are you doing, Mason? Uh, with your uh, new fin? Yeah. Star Wars fin? Uh-huh. Not sure how long we're gonna go. Last week we went 13. We'll see what the shortest distance is for today. So maybe 13 again, maybe 12. We'll see how it goes. And then later on, we and I are doing our full of brick live stream with the new microphone. This is the first time we're going to use a new microphone. We'll see how that goes. And in terms of building stuff, we'll see again what happens today. We just finished our run and it was good. We ran 11.3, 11.3? 11 11.35 kilometers in... 58 minutes and 18 seconds and Tristan was fast. We ran with the nomads up until the first water break and then we just went back from there. They kept on going. They're going 20 plus, 26, 27. But it was good. How do you feel? Good. Good? Now we're gonna head back. Here is Tristan's fight scene between Darth Vader and Kylo Ren and Rey. Finn. Oh, Finn. Oops, how embarrassing. So it is Sunday morning and we're on our way to the gym. Me, myself, Hayson, Hayson Hayden, and Mason. Oh, oh dear job. Lord. Anyways, uh, Mason has swimming classes today and he is on to the next level. So that's a new teacher today. And I'm thinking for today, I'm gonna try to give swimming with Hayden a try. There's a um, family, pool? family pool where the entry level is basically like a beach. You just kind of walk in. I was kind of getting lazy this morning thinking maybe I won't do it, but really it's so difficult for me to work out, go back and forth, bring Mason back to the swimming and then it's only 30 minutes and then get him showered, that there's really no point trying to work out this morning. Or is there? Yesterday was quite the lesson because we went to the gym later in the morning think, and I thought it was going to be okay, but it was terrible. There were just so many people in the gym. People give it up! If it's not going to be your regular lifestyle choice, stop going to the gym. Really. And taking all my parking. Yes, I'm feeling selfish. It is my birthday weekend. Terrible, terrible, aren't I? So yes, Mason and myself and Hayden are going to go try to swim at the family pool. No one's there this early in the morning. It's nine o'clock. Hopefully no one's there early this morning because it is my birthday season and I really cannot suck in my gut. Oh well, what else has been going on? Are you trying to make noises with the classical sound? Anyhow, we are uh, not doing much later on today. I think Nick and I have our live stream, although he's probably like the live stream guru at this point, live streaming all the time. Yes, you, I'm talking to you, Nick. And uh, after that, nothing. I might go out later. I get cabin fever around 3 p.m., 4 p.m. Maybe get groceries, but I think we're good for groceries even. Ah, I don't know what to do. Maybe, just maybe, if I don't work out this morning and you no, know, swimming does not count as work, working out for me because I'm not really swimming, rather splashing in the water with Hayden, I will probably return to the gym and then do my workout. My foot still hurts, which is a little bit frustrating because I don't know how I'll be able to run my future race. It's weird. Um, I do work out uh, and use a Stairmaster and I tried the elliptical yesterday but still every morning it still feels tender my foot um, this morning not as tender as before but still I think I still have to baby that foot until I feel no tenderness in the morning just finished building another set and this is Ray Speeder and it's cool this is from the movie, The Star Wars Force Awakens. We get Rey, we get a little um, thug, and that's Rey's mask. Cool. I'm still reading Year of Yes by Shonda Rhimes. I don't know what it is about reading with the eyes, but I pass out pretty much after a chapter in. I am listening to the book called The Dinner, which is um, a translation novel. I think it's Dutch originally. It's quite good. I had a friend who read it and it has high reviews too. I had a friend who read it and she said towards the end it kind of fizzled out. But you know how sometimes you listen to somebody's opinions and suddenly 
you actually enjoyed the book more than the negative opinion. But the reverse could be true too when you're gushing about something and then somebody watches a movie that you're gushing over or reads a book you're gushing over and they're like, meh. So I think the best case scenario is really just try not to listen to opinions, which is very difficult because we are so ruled by, well, not ruled, but influenced by others' opinions. Uh, tonight is the Oscars night. I don't know whether we should be, ooh, maybe we could dress up because it's Oscars night. That's a fun idea for our live stream. So I think it was a pretty good organized morning. I took Hayden and Mason to swimming at, at nine o'clock. Swam with Hayden for about an hour and he is fearless. The kid's just gonna drown himself. He doesn't understand that not breathing in the water. But, and then I was able to do my cardio and my weights. So, I mean, shorter, but at least it's done. I don't have to go back tomorrow or later. And now I just want some fried chicken. So what did you end up doing at the gym? Hula hooping. Hula hooping? How about you? What did you do? I saw you playing with the groceries. Did you have fun? Yeah. Yes. And you had you like swimming? Yeah. You want to go swimming again? Yeah. Bubbles, bubbles, bubbles. Yeah. Splash, splash, splash. Oh dear. So mm -hmm. wait, are you you're not gonna eat the chicken if I buy it? No.